today we're going to be looking at these backpack cots by Isco. They're aluminum, they weigh about six and a half pounds each, and they can support 330 pounds. And I'm going to see if I can make this work for me inside of my small overland camper. Let's go. So that was easy enough. Uh, there's, there's only one sided where you can put it in. The other side doesn't have a, a passage through or pass through. So you gotta put it into one side and it locks into the other end. And then you pull these little, these little tabs right here and it locks inside. So that's good that the poles won't come out. Now we gotta put on the supports. This thing doesn't weigh anything. So now you have somewhere to put the personal items. Ugh. This is, you know, I didn't think I was gonna like, I didn't think I was gonna like these. Uh, I, uh, I did a, a review and a test on the uh, disco beds and I thought I would like the disco beds better. As a matter of fact, I was gonna send these back without even trying them. I said, you know what? Let me try them, let me do a review. And Insane light, super compact, easy, easily storable, and you can backpack with this. Ten camp, you're off the ground, or you want to lay a little lower, that works too. 
uh, but it's a little bit shorter than the disco bed um, bunk bed system that I that I purchased. So it gives me more, I guess, allows me more room to come in and out, and uh, it's not as bulky. So and because it's so light, I can move it around. Um, I mean, it's it's comfortable. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. It. I don't know if I would be able to uh, to say if this or the disco bed is 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 any more. One is more comfortable than the other. I think they're both about the same. But I don't know. I think to my surprise, I think. I don't know. I can have another one there and still have enough room to walk around. I wonder if they'll fit sideways. I'm just curious, but I gotta check. It won't fit. It will not fit. Too bad. But. It supports 330 pounds. They weigh about six and a half pounds each. They're probably, I mean, I was thinking about opening up the second cot just to see how it would be in here, but the outer measurements on this is 25 and a half inches. The inner measurements where, where you wouldn't be hitting the poles is right around 23 and three quarters. And the length on this is 70, 75 and a half inches. So six feet, three and a half inches. So the package comes it's it's 20 inches in the package again six and a half pounds and about eight inches thick and it has this Molly style straps so you can strap it onto your backpack so if I had both of these cots open inside my camper and again my camper is Sixty, sixty-eight, roughly sixty-eight, sixty-eight and a half inches wide. So if I had another cot opened up, that would put me at another twenty-five and a half. So it's gonna leave me roughly 19, about 19 to 20 inches of walking space. And if I put the other cot lower, it'll just make it feel that much bigger. So question, is it worth it? I paid roughly $300 uh, with taxes on this and uh, Man, I like them. I like, I mean, the disco beds were nice, but they were heavy. Disco beds are 36, 36 pounds a bag. There's two bags. You don't have to bring both bags. You can bring one bag, one cot, just like this is one cot. But I can easily take these bags and check it out. So here's a plus for me. And if you're lacking on storage, this is a plus for you.
So I built this cabinet in this camper. I have a TV right there. But what I did here, because this camper has such little uh, storage is, I put all my storage back here. So for me, this is where this wins. And I could put the other one back here. The other one can go here, and that works for me. So, let me know what you think. You guys tell me. So, Is this a keeper? So I, I'm comparing this to the disco bed uh, setup, bunk beds. Um, it gives me more floor space, but they're heavy. They, uh, you have to, you know, to stack them. If you wanted to stack them, um, you gotta put them together. Um, it'll help, it'll help if you had help or have someone with you to put them together, but you can do them by, by yourself. They're just, you know, convenient, then you gotta store them away. And this right here, I'm, I'm blown away. So, how easy, how easy is it, is it, is it to, uh, to put away? Let's find out. guys let me know what you think uh, is this worth I believe it was 289 for a pair uh, the disco bed was about a hundred dollars more so roughly 489 uh, 389 I'm sorry so three versus 400 super compact super lightweight easily storable and it doesn't feel as bulky so you let me know and you're probably going to see in my next video which one I went with. But for now, give me a thumbs up, like, share, subscribe, and leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. Thanks for watching.